Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we're going to be going over what's on my coffee table, different options that I change it to when I get bored with a certain look. But if you're new to the channel, my name is Anthony Arazzo and I do men's lifestyle tips, men's style, and creative content. So if you like those type of videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Also hit the little bell so you get a notification every time I upload a video. So without any further ado, let's hop right into the video and I'll show you what I have on my coffee table. So first let's talk about this gold coffee table. So used to be blackish brown I got it from Ikea it was about 50 bucks so not that expensive um, and I made it kind of distressed so the first setup we're gonna do is this glass pillar that I found from TJ Maxx it was really inexpensive it was about eight dollars and then I'm gonna pair that with this black tray that I also got from TJ Maxx and then I like to put these books on top in a nice color palette which is usually black and white and then these Bed Bath & Beyond stone coasters that I got gifted to me that's the first setup second setup we're gonna do the pillar again with with the tray and then we're gonna do the stone little candle holder that I put some stones in and then the coasters and then the books down on the bottom platform so that's another setup that I like it's very simple um, and minimalist so the next setup that we're gonna do is a stone candle holder with the glass pillar. And then we're gonna do another tray that I found actually at a thrift store for $2 and then put the coasters right on there. That's another setup that I like to have or I can alternate it with the books. The last setup that we're gonna do is the glass pillar with the tray and then the books on top and also the coasters. Or we can also change it up with this glass vase that I found also for $2 at a thrift store. Um, I thought it would kind of look modern um, and I can put some greenery in there or something just to kind of liven up the space and then put my coasters on the side. Or I can have this other setup where I just put everything else on the tray and then have those two items there. So that's another setup that I like to have. So those are my setups that I like to have just to change things up and just make things look a little bit different. So that is pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video, found it helpful. Hopefully it gave you some ideas of what you can put on your coffee table if you're kind of struggling. I sort of didn't know what to put on my coffee table because I kind of like the more minimalistic look, but I didn't want it to be empty. So hopefully this gave you some insight and ideas of what you can do with yours. But if you like the video, definitely give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Also, let me know if you have any other ideas for me that I can check out in the comments and I will see you in the next video.